Hey guys, what's up? This is Amy and today I am bringing you my empties video. This is my first one ever so you guys are going to see that I have collected quite a few things in this video. Um, I am not dumping things out or anything like that just to make these kind of videos. So um, like I said, they're collective. So I've been using these things for quite a while now. And uh, what I have on my face or a tutorial of this look right here, um, go ahead and leave it down in the comments below. What I have on my lips is is um, Wet n Wild's 908C in Sugar Plum Fairy, and then I just topped it off with um, Maybelline's 120 Plum Luster. It's this one right here, and that's what so I have on my So let's list. go ahead and jump right in. The first items that I have, I'm just going to do them as a group. Um, I am in love with these L'Oreal Paris Advanced Hair Care Shampoos. As you can see, I've gone through quite a few and I've tried all of them um, just to see how well that they work. Um, I tried the to Total Repair 5 Restoring Shampoo. It seems to do five things is what it says. It claims to do five things. Uh, rebuild fibers, strength, vitality, silkiness, and shine. It's for damaged, overworked hair. And honestly, you guys, I love this whole line of shampoos. I would definitely repurchase them again. Um, I also have the P Power Moisture. This one is for normal to dry hair. And then this one is the smooth intense for unmanageable frizzy hair. And um, I do have hair that is dry, coarse, thick, um, that I need to um, moisturize and smooth down. So I've been using these for a little while and I feel like they are definitely doing the job. So I would recommend these and uh, definitely the repurchase them. The second item that I have are just uh, uh, a boring thing it's just the q-tips with the precision tips um, I love these for different uses um, when I am doing my nails I dip them in uh, the nail polish remover and I can go around and get the edges of the ones that I messed up on or um, makeup um, they're wonderful for liquid liner when you have messed up on that so different uses I really love these and I am definitely going to be really I have the Batiste dry shampoo um, this is in the dark and deep brown I ran out about I think it was the day before yesterday and I'm very sad I have yet to make a trip to TJ Maxx to get this um, but like I said this is my all-time fave dry shampoo and so I would highly recommend this and I'm definitely gonna be repurchasing this um, another item that I am going to group together are these soft soap uh, body washes. This one is the Ultra Rich Shea Butter and Almond Oil. And then I have this one, um, which is the Heavenly Vanilla Body Butter. And uh, this one was my favorite. This one smells so, so good. Um, I will definitely be repurchasing these again. Um, these are not expensive at all. I think they're a little less than $4. Um, when I bought these together, they were having like a two for $4 sale. So that's why I bought these together. And I, I just love how soft they make your body feel. So um, like I said, I would definitely be repurchasing these. Another item that I am going to talk about is the L'Oreal Paris Hair Whoa! Expertise New Everstyle Mousse. It's the Curl Activating Mousse. Um, as far as... Whoops, I'm sorry guys, I bumped the camera. As far as this mousse, um, I did not feel like it would curl any more than any other Whoa! mousse. Um, it just makes your hair stiff and hard. Um, the smell was really nice, but I will not be repurchasing this again only because I like the kind of mousse that it works, but it doesn't leave your hair crispy. I like to be able to run my fingers through my hair and it be soft. I do not like that crispy, hard um, feel, so I will not be repurchasing Um, the other thing that I have, I'm sorry at you guys, as you guys can see, I have a lot of hair care products and a lot okay. of shower so, products. So, um, this next item is the Paul Mitchell Super Skinny Serum, and it's right here. 
and I have gone through two of these. I just wanted to show one of the bottles. I think it works great when I am going to straighten my hair. It doesn't leave your hair greasy. Um, it smells nice and it works really well um, to straighten. I just feel like it definitely gives you that very straight, straight look when you use this. So um, a little goes a long way. I'm sorry there's hairs all over it. That's gross, I know. Um, but just a little bit goes a long way. So if you're doing two and three pumps, yes, your hair will get greasy. But if you're doing like half a pump, um, depending on how much hair you have too, I have a lot of hair and one pump seems to do the job for me. But you know, half pump for people who um, don't have much hair, you don't want to give yourself that greasy look and try to avoid the roots. I just do it kind of like in the longer parts of my hair. So I will definitely be repurchasing. Another them. one that I have is a little sample that I received from Mario Badescu. It was when I ordered the rose water uh uh, setting spray that I received this it's just a lotion it's the honey moisturizer and I am definitely going to be repurchasing the full size of this I just used it for my hands and oh my gosh it made my hands so soft I get really dry hands only because I use a lot of hand sanitizer um, you know when I'm cleaning the house and stuff I should use gloves but I don't but um, anyway, it made my hands super, super soft. I definitely noticed a difference with this uh, moisturizer, so I will be purchasing the full size of it. Okay, so on to the few makeup items that I have. Um, the first one is going to be the L'Oreal Paris Magic Lumi Concealer Slash Corrector. Uh, this is what I used. I did not use this as a concealer. I used it as... Um, here's that right there I used it as a highlight under my eyes here the only thing is is that I purchased it in the um well I did get fair in the color 860 fair but I just feel like it was not light enough to highlight I felt like it was almost skin tone so um I'm gonna go and see if they have a lighter color but other than that it worked really well and I would be repurchasing this Another item that I have is the Maybelline uh, Mega Plush Volume Express Mascara, and it looks like this. And as far as this, you guys, um, I loved the wand, uh, the bristles on the wand. I loved the formula. I loved everything about it. The only thing that was the deal breaker for me is that the wand is very flimsy. You guys can see very flimsy at the end okay so I really like the bristles but the wand is too flimsy for me I felt like I couldn't get the maximum capacity of that mascara because it bent so much that it would not let me to get in between my lashes the way I wanted it to. So I probably will not be purchasing this. But like I said, the bristles and the formula and everything else was great. So I don't know. Maybe I could learn to work around that. But for now, I will the not be. The next item is also a mascara. It's the CoverGirl Mascara. I think it's called the... Everlast Fusion. I, I don't know. It has rubbed off. It's CoverGirl, I know, and it's a purple one. So I don't know if you guys know which one it is. Um, I would definitely be repurchasing this one. This is what the brush looks like. It reminds me of the um, Rocket, the, the Maybelline Rocket, exactly, to the T to me. Um, that's what it reminds me of. So, yes, I will be repurchasing this one. I really liked it. There was um, another no one that I have is just a sample. It's the Jurgens Shea Butter. And I really liked it. It's deep conditioning moisturizer with pure African Shea Butter. Um, I felt like it really, the, the one time that I used it, it was not greasy. Um, it really left my hands feeling nice and moisturized. So, I might be repurchasing the full size. I'm not sure I have a full size of the regular Jergens lotion that I really enjoy um, but maybe when I run out I will be repurchasing the full size of that. is the Tree Hut uh, Shea Sugar Body Scrub Scrub in Almond Honey and it looks like this I'm sorry you guys there's like water and gunk in there but this 
I absolutely loved. Everybody in my house used it. My daughter, Ariana, who is sitting right here, wants to let you guys know how much she liked this. It would definitely... Go ahead and let them know, Ariana, how well this thing worked. Like, it works for, like, your feet and your knees. Like, if, you, if your knees, like, feel a rough. rough, you can, like, put this on it. It feels so soft. Next, it, makes, it makes your body feel almost warm. Yeah. I don't know if this is it's just in our imagination, it, but when you... When you put it on your knees or on your feet, it gives it like almost like this warm sensation. So let them know. Are we going to be buying another one of those, yes, you think? Yes, Bye, guys. We will All right. So that was my daughter. She's five years old. Her name is Ariana. And she wanted to let you guys know how much we all love this stuff. Like I said, uh, we went through it so fast just because we are a family of four and all of us were using it. So yes, we are definitely going to be purchasing this Tree Hut Shea Sugar Body Scrub in the future. We got it um, from Walmart, I believe, and it was like on clearance. It was like super cheap. So I'm going to go back and hopefully they will have it um, there. So all right, you guys, that's all I have you know, for if you guys empties. want to keep you uh, seeing these empties videos, and I will keep doing them. I know that they're not going to be as often, only because, like I said, I do not go through items that quickly unless they're like shower items. Um, so go ahead and comment down below if you want to see the look that I have on my face. Um, this top that I am wearing right now, I don't know if you guys can see it, it's just this flannel top with the rhinestones on the pocket I got from Kohl's, and it was on sale for $29.99, so seen these empty vis empties videos, go ahead and give, um, a thumbs up, leave any comments down below, any requests of any videos that you guys want to see, please let me know, I thank you so, so much for subscribing and watching my videos, um, I do this for you guys, okay, I am wanting to share my knowledge with you and I highly enjoy doing that so thank you guys again so much for watching uh, we'll see you in my next video bye